Welcome back guys, Gvids here. Uh, today's episode, I'm just going to show you guys a quick and easy spot where we can uh, gather ourselves some quick fish. Uh, so if you do want to get to this spot, I'll zoom all the way out and all the way back in so you know exactly where to go. Once you make it to this point though guys, just whip out the old fishing pole. And I'm just going to stop right here. I got myself a new mic. Uh, so all those guys that didn't like my audio before, um, this is the best it's going to get. I got the Zenningzer, Zenningheiser, whatever the hell it's called, uh, GSP-300. Bought it with my Air Miles points. Uh, they're around the $120 mark, I believe. But anyways, guys, uh, I just wanted to quickly say that. I don't know why it has nothing to do with the video, but uh, a little upgrade to the channel, I guess, since I got myself a new mic that should be better. Uh, hopefully it doesn't sound as shitty as all my other mics have. Um, but anyways guys, all you're going to do is throw the fishing pole out there. Now at this spot here, we can actually run through the water and knock them onto shore. Uh, while we're fishing, they're most likely just going to swim themselves up onto shore anyways. And we can also catch them with a rod. So we have lots of ways to do it here. Uh, I saw some lar or some, sorry, some smallmouth out the back there, so I'm going to bring those in. I really like this mic though. Uh, it's a two-eared one. I'm first time I've actually ever owned a two-eared mic. I've always just had the single ears going in. Oh shit, we got one on. Perfect. That's what we want. So once you drag a few in, like I said guys, whenever I make video it always takes a little bit longer, but you can do the short cast and drag them in. I just noticed that there was a small mouth out there, so I wanted to go and bring him in. And as you see on the side there, we got some bullhead catfish just swimming themselves off to shore. I do got some commotion going around me, but uh, hopefully all those guys leave me alone. I'm pretty sure they will. So I'm just going to run through the water a bit and knock some fish out and gather them that way. Go and pick up these. I'm actually not going to speed up any footage today. I was only here for about six minutes. And that's with me uh, talking and basically doing my thing. Holy crap. It's like thunder out there, man. Something big's going off over there. <laughs> Anyways, I really hope that stays over there and then they can let me be my own. So far, so good. And even my horse is getting scared. I really hope you guys can hear me clearly. I didn't really test the mic at all. I uh, just put it in my controller and started making my video. <laughs> so I hope it sounds good. Uh, this is the last mic I'm buying, so I'm really hoping that you guys can enjoy it. And... Uh, hearing me clear enough uh, where you're not going to get all staticky and all like all my other mics. Hopefully I can laugh a little bit into this one without having the sound of wind blowing around. But as I was saying, just walk around, collect the fish as they come out to the water. And if you notice that you can't knock any more out, just take the old fishing pole out and go back to the fishing method. But there's tons of little fish here. Uh, the obviously the money is in the uh, smallmouth bass. They're worth two dollars and twenty four, two dollars and fifty cents. What am I saying? Each. Uh, so after you get ten, you have twenty five dollars. Plus, if you uh, break them down, you can get another four dollars from the flakes. But and if you actually are you doing the knockout the method, if you get a, some smallmouth bass out of the water, which I will be at the end. Uh, I'm not going to kick them, but you more you can kick them and it knocks them down and you can actually bring in some more. But I like to switch it up. I do some not running around. I got ADD guys and I hate standing still. So that's why I really like spots like this where I can kind of do a little fishing, running around in some circles, knock some fish out. Bam, we got another one on. That's another $2.50. Really easy fish to get guys. Really easy spot. And another good thing is we're super close to the butchers. It is literally just down the train tracks and it does not take very much time at all. We got some smallies right in front. So just do some nice short casts. And like I said, if you don't get nothing on the cast, then just switch up and start running through the water and they'll get knocked out. So it looks here, I'm not really getting any bites. And they're all gone. So fuck that. I'm just going to switch up. And we'll knock them out of the water now. Here's a nice little batch of smallmouth. 
There's five dollars. There's ten bucks just sitting right there for us, guys. That's awesome. Nice and easy. But I'm not gonna keep you guys on for too much longer here. Pick these guys up and pretty much cut it to an end. But I really hope this spot could help you guys out at all. I have showcased this area before for some birds and uh, before they made some patches. Um, so I thought I'd just come back and try it again. So this is not it's not a new spot here guys by any means. Uh, I wasn't trying to portray that as a new spot. But it's just a great way of making some extra cash if you guys have not been here yet. But anyways, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys enjoy the new mic. And I'll just kind of show you guys we're not far away from the butchers whatsoever. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the new mic and everything else. And uh, thank you very much for supporting the channel and sticking around with me, guys. You guys are absolutely amazing. And I will catch you on the next one. Peace.